Is he trying to poison me? Hey guys, it's Darcy Simmer and welcome back to my channel. Today I have another part of Twinbrook Architect. I'm sorry if I just blew into my microphone just then. I don't know what just happened. But uh yeah, we're in a bit of a bad mood today. She is stir crazy and she was burglarized. But luckily um the cops got here in time. I woke her up and called you. Go away. I don't I don't care. But uh yeah, let me just go ahead and replace that. Okay, he stole a lot of things. What? No, okay, I built that. That was sent to her in the mail. I guess I had a lamp over here that he stole, so let's just go ahead and stick that back in there. I knew he stole something over here, but I wasn't sure what it was. I thought I had a something hanging on the wall or something, I don't know. But I'll just go ahead and replace those. And then this, um, she crafted. And then this right here was sent to her in the mail by someone who is in love with her. I don't know who, but they sent it to her. And it's fine, you know, whatever. So she's just gonna make her bed and stuff. When does she start working? One hour, and she did get her job level up to level six, because apparently just by painting and stuff. Um, increases her job performance and there is snow on the ground because um, yeah my sims game well whenever origin updates all of my options reset in the sims 3 I don't know why it does that but it does it's annoying but um, yeah so I had to do I have mail I don't know we're gonna find out but um, yeah I have to redo all of my options and everything so yeah, and then I thought that it turned all of the weather and stuff back on, but it didn't. And I did change it to where it's only spring um, all the time instead of going throughout the seasons because it, I don't, it's just better that way. And I did turn off zombies because sometimes at night she needs to take out the garbage and they attack her. So, uh, yeah, turned off zombies and I'm not sure what else I did, but uh, yeah. Okay, so we have some jobs available. She kind of had to finish that, and I did have her work on some stuff, so she's got a few. Okay. I also um, went to the map, this, and then went over to the city hall and reset the entire town because um, I was getting this glitch thing where it just, like, every few seconds, it would just, the game would stop, and then it'd wait for just a few minutes, and then it'd go again. And it's really annoying. So, um, yeah, I had to reset the town. It seemed to fix it pretty well. I don't know what that was, but um, hopefully it doesn't continue. Because uh, if it does, then unfortunately I'm probably going to have to switch towns. I do have the um, mover, traveler things installed. Show you here. Yeah, I got the mover, the traveler, stiff installed. So if she does have to switch towns, she'll still have her relationships and everything. Not that it really matters, because I'm not going to have her focus on relationships, but, uh, yeah, she'll still have it. But, um, I may have to move towns, but hopefully that won't be the case. Um, let's see, what do we have? We've got a single ladies den. We've got a book nook. Um, I think we've done both of these. Um, this one's closer, so I guess we can go ahead and do this one. Now that I've reorganized my life, got rid of old clothes, and put 600 pairs of shoes in storage, I'm now ready to have my place redesigned. Can you help me out? We need lights, sofa, video game system, rug, and expensive TV. 15,000 simoleons. Okay, she must be rich. Oh, penny pincher. Hmm. I think I've done something for her before, but I'm not sure. We'll go. We'll see. We'll see what she wants. Visit lot and um, see if we actually know her. Let's see. Here she is. Um, doesn't look like we know any of her traits or anything, so I don't know. Well, now I have mail. Thanks. Is that Simfest. Got a gift from Juan. Thank you. And got a letter. Find you attractive, but I couldn't tell you in person. No. Oh. Okay, so this person must be a celebrity or the taxi driver was a celebrity. Okay, so this is the one where we had to do the exterior, which was terrible. So I'm glad we actually get to work on the interior a little bit here. So that'll be fun. It looks like they got some Christmas lights up, so that's cool. Mm -hmm. You just wait. I like the icicles. I really love winter in this game. It's my favorite. But, yeah, I have to turn it off because it lags my game pretty bad. So, um, do we learn anything about her? I, I want to I wanna talk to her. Um, take measurements. Oh, right, I can do that. Um, and I don't, I don't, hmm, let's get to know her, I guess. See if we can learn anything. Then we'll take measurements. See if that helps us out any. And we're supposed to be doing a single ladies' den 
Even though she's not single, I'm guessing this is her husband, Clark Pedler. Penny Pincher. Maybe it's. Yeah, I don't know what's happening. But um, I think this room over here. Yeah. We'll do this room over here. She's charismatic, party animal, schmoozer, heavy sleeper. Great. Okay, apparently we want to do it in here. I don't know why she keeps wearing this. I'm guessing it's because she's eccentric. Maybe? Let's see. Yeah, I don't know. We're gonna measure the bathroom too. I don't know why, but we're gonna do it. It's a really ugly bathroom. I can't I can't wait to decorate that bathroom. Honestly, it's awful. He doesn't like me. Okay, he's not happy she hired me. Even though he hired me the first time. They got clothes and everything and, and we're still taking measurements. Okay, we're gonna go outside now. I'm gonna have to change her <laughs> into her um, outerwear because it's pretty cold outside. Yeah, 33 degrees. It's about the same as it is where I live, honestly. I think it's like... Oh, he's a witch. Wizard. Except the excitement. Assignment, not excitement. I'm gonna begin the renovation. But, uh, yeah, where I live right now, it's like 46 degrees outside. My feet are frozen. Let's do this without getting hypothermia. I've got on two pairs of socks, so hopefully be great. Waiting for the clients. Yeah, I know. Mm, so pretty. Anyway, let's go over here. Okay, so party animal. I don't actually know what that means. I should probably Google that. Let me, let me, let me just look that up real quick because I don't know. Okay, so I did a little bit of research and it looks like... Okay, let me just go ahead and delete this stuff while I'm talking. But um, it looks like whenever you're doing a job... Yes? Okay, hang on. Okay, so it looks like um, for Sims with the party animal trait, they like bars to be added to their room. So I'm going to have to try to remember to add a bar in here. Which, I mean, it'll be fine in this room because it's a single ladies den. So that'll be great. And um, yeah, it helps towards the score if you do the take measurements, which I did. So that's good. And you can also apparently speak to the client about the renovation. I don't know if I have that option yet. Um, I know it's like, <laughs> it's no trail, but I know it's like a certain level you have to get to before you can do that. So I'm going to go ahead and see if I can actually do that real quick. Okay, this is going to happen. Let's go. Let's go. Please, please don't, please don't crash. Okay, thank you. Um, no, we're not, we're not complete. Okay, and other things they like besides, um, using like custom made objects and stuff. Random about dark room. I'm not doing that. I don't think I can actually do it just yet. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. Um, no. Okay. Well, then we'll just begin the rumination. Continue. But, um, they also like whenever you use objects from World Adventures. So I might actually, um, go to a consignment store or, um, yeah, go to the consignment store and place in, like, a, world, some World Adventure cash registers and stuff in there. And just, you know, tweak that a little bit so that I can actually go there and buy some stuff, uh, um, from the consignment store seller things. I don't know what they're called in World Adventures. I can't even remember. I haven't played it in a really long time. But, uh, yeah. I'm gonna do that because I don't, I don't want to go there in this playthrough. Is he trying to poison me? Okay, anyway. <laughs> let's get on to the renovation.
Okay, so I believe I have everything. Yes, it looks like I do. So, uh, yeah, this is what I came up with for a single ladies den. I'm really not sure what else to do in here. Honestly, she had such a large budget. So I just, I did switch out the um, bar for, uh, I believe it's the most expensive one, actually. Um, let's see, yeah, this one right here, the Duke Professional Juice Bar, it's 1,200 simoleons. So that went up quite a bit. And I believe I had, I just had this one before, which is only 384 simoleons. So since she had such a large budget and I had extra because I deleted everything that was in the room before. Um, I did actually forget to add things to the coffee table, so let me just do that real quick. Okay, really didn't take much off the budget, but I just added this little cake dish thing. You know, maybe she has friends over. Maybe she has friends. I don't know. And then just some flowers and this little glass bird because I think it's pretty so yeah I guess we're just gonna turn it in and see if she likes it hopefully she does I don't know I feel like this area could use more but I just don't like really long walls and I don't know what to do with them and then I just added in the little nectar thing because she's gonna have a bar you know she's a party animal so I figured she might like a nectar wreck and so yeah I did use a lot of metallic textures in here just some wooden metallic um, I used like the white metal for most of everything instead of the rose gold this time since I did use it quite a lot in um I don't know if it's the last part of the part before that I think it was the part before that but um we're just gonna turn in the renovation now and see if she likes it hopefully she does I don't know where I'm at okay here we are you're leaving come back why does she look different here than she does in her picture doesn't make sense <gasps> kitty we turn it in yeah we're gonna watch her evaluate if they can even get in the house because there's a cat there. Yep, okay, they can. Maybe. Nope, they're gonna wait. I don't think I'd be out in the snow with no shoes on, but, you know, to each their own. Also, I did read that it would help to get the... Where is it at? Right here. Let me check real quick. I read that it would help to get, um... Hmm. Is it other, maybe? don't know. Maybe social. Yes, this one. Inappropriate, but in a good way. That way you can test objects to make sure they're accessible. So I'm going to go ahead and get that because she's got 17,000 simoleons. Not simoleons, but points. So I'm going to go ahead and get that. That way for future she can... Okay, cat, you need to move. Go away, kitty. Come on. Kitty. Okay, well I guess she's going to just tell me. We're still upset about the burglary, but it's fine. Okay, so I guess she liked it since this popped up. Let's see, overall, I think you did a good job. That bar is going to be so awesome for parties. Also, I absolutely love all this handcrafted objects you used. You did okay. Thanks for trying. Or 900 simoleons and a 500 simoleon bonus, so that's pretty good. I think that might be the best we've had so far, so that's... Hello. That's awesome. I guess he's a celebrity and she's not. Hmm. I don't know, maybe he's like a famous car person, maybe. I don't know. Okay. We're just gonna go ahead and take a picture. Don't mind us. Um, where should we take it? Right here, I guess. That works. Well. Awesome. On to the next renovation. What's this? Simfest. I don't care about your Simfest. Several of my friends have been sending me new books to read. I'm really enjoying them, but I just don't have anywhere to put them. Could you help me build a new library for my home? Sure, why not? Stereo, bookshelves, TV, coffee table, living chair. 4,300 simoleons. 400 base fee. Whatever that means. I guess that's like the money they're supposed to give me. I don't know. But yeah. Okay. Uh, Should I go to the consignment store first? Let me pause this real quick while I think. Where am I? I'm right here. Consignment store's over here. You know what? Let's go to the consignment store real quick. See if there's anything in here worth buying. purchasing. Um. Hello? I really hate this. I really hate this, honestly. Like, why build it so big if you're just gonna leave it empty? I mean, whatever. Okay, we're just gonna buy some stuff. Come on, let's go. What is- oh, okay. Well, I guess we already went to the house. Let's go to the consignment store afterwards. Visit. No one's home, right? Nope. We're gonna take measurements anyway. 
Okay, and I believe we've actually done this before. Where are you going? You're not going home! Come take measurements! There's 700 salons. Okay, so we're here. Hello, Alma. We're gonna talk to you, probably. Okay, so we've actually done this before, haven't we? Not that. Yeah, we did over here in this little- This was the book nook we did before- No, it was the writer studio. Okay, so I guess we'll do the book nook up in their bedroom, I guess, because I, I can't do it down here unless I put it over here in this corner, but that'd be kind of weird. Um, I don't know, I'll just have to check around and see. Is she the one I'm supposed to be doing the thing for? Yeah, I don't actually know what level I have to be before I can talk to them about the renovation. And I don't know if she's the one that I'm supposed to be doing the renovation for. But I think I did learn both of their traits before. So that should be good. Um, yeah, I don't think there'd be enough room for a book nook over here. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna do it upstairs in their bedroom. Probably be the best bet. So, yeah. Let's begin renovation. Alright, we know no traits, so that's great. Um, yeah, I think over in this area, maybe a little bit over here. Spillage. Actually, hmm. They got a chair over here. I guess we could put it over here in this area, right? Yeah. I think that'd be, go that'd be okay. So let's just go ahead and get started, shall we? Alright, so it looks like I have everything. Um, yeah, I did recolor all the objects they had because they're just really ugly. I changed the floor and everything. I changed the wall this time and I know I, I, know I didn't do anything downstairs whenever I renovated it. I just matched it in with what was already there, but uh, I just don't like it, honestly. I'll probably go um, back and recolor this at some point. Hopefully, I'll be able to come back to their house sometime and recolor that. But yeah, I like the upstairs. That's very pretty. I did use some of the rose gold and stuff again. And a lot of pink and blue because there's just two women that live here. These, no, her and someone else who is not here. Blaze Kindle, probably. I don't know. But uh, yeah, these are just some paintings I had in your inventory. <laughs> They're not great. But, you know, they work. And we've got 392 simoleons left. I could put something right there, but um, let's see if I can find something. Yeah. I can go there. It'll work. And then we'll just give it a rose gold frame. It will work. That'd be pretty, right? I did forget to color that flower. 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 Pot. Fluff. Plant. So there we go. Yep. Just drag and drop. It's great. 
and this scares me. I don't know if your sims can actually get through that. Let's just scoot that over a little bit, okay? Hopefully everything's accessible. Um, I could go in and check, but honestly I can't be bothered to do that. But, uh, yeah, hopefully, hopefully it does. But, uh, yeah, we're just gonna re return the renovation, turn in the renovation, see if, um, hopefully they'll like it. Oh, sure, now you yell, jerk. Really need to talk to her and get to know her traits and stuff. Okay, I got a great review, so that's good. Congratulations. Got promoted. Awesome. Yeah. Um, overall, I think you did a great job. I love all those handcrafted objects you used this high with your work that I'm not sure I'll be able to leave my house again. I'm just so happy here. Yes! 1,400 simoleons plus a 1,000 simoleon bonus. So that's great. So I think we got a great review. We did awesome progress. Research. It helps. Yes. Okay. <laughs> um, I don't know how long I've been recording, honestly. So I don't know if we have time for another renovation or not. Um, we might. So I'm just gonna um, play this through the night. See if we got a we get any good renovations tomorrow. Uh, you know, I'll just take a picture of you. Why not? Boom. All right, so I'm just gonna send her home. It's already 5:55, so she doesn't have time to do another renovation tonight. Not that she had any. I don't know when she'll be able to just like go around and ask people if she can do renovations and like show them her portfolio and it. <laughs> words, portfolio and everything. But um, we'll figure it out. Then I'm just gonna skip through the night for you guys so you don't have to watch it. And I will be back tomorrow and see what jobs she has available. All right, it's the next day. Her sink is broken, her toilet is broken, so we're just gonna have to fix that up a little bit. And it's almost eight o'clock, so I can see what um, jobs she has available. And her phone's ringing. I don't really care, honestly. But uh, yeah, we're just gonna hello, horsey. Fix this up. Wait till eight, which is now. See what jobs she has available. Come on, pop up. Nothing. On the clock. Main cave. I don't want to do a main cave. I did a lady cave. Okay, I think I have to go back to her. Okay. Let's see, we got a gym edition. I don't really care for gyms or main caves. Um, I guess we could do a main cave. Have we done a main cave before? I guess we'll see what they want. Hi. Speak to learn about renovation. Thinking about dating again, but I can't bring my dates back to this place. I need something stylish and sleek. Can you help me out? All right, buddy Bailey, what you want? Um, lights, stereo, sofa, bar, and an expensive TV. Oh, this is another really large budget. Okay. I don't know if I want to do this, because it's basically the same thing as I did with the ladies' den, except... masculine. <laughs> um. Hmm. I'm going to think about this. You know, I guess, I guess we could do it. Why not? I have to find Buddy Bailey because I don't know where he ran off to. He's not home. Some other lady's home. Poker flat strap. Okay. But he's wanting to date more, but he's also... Okay. Let's go. Let's just... Come on. We can fix up your house later. So he's not home. I'm gonna see if I can call him here, maybe? Where is he? Buddy Bailey, right here. Invite over. Sorry, I'm too busy to talk. I'll try calling back in five hours. He must be at work or something. So that's unfortunate. But we'll take some measurements. See how we lock this place. Just look around real quick, see where we can build. So we need a man cave. Okay, so we've got a little desk area over here. We've got this huge entrance area, which doesn't make sense, but it's okay. And we've got this room over here. Okay, and then there's like an outside stairs up place in the middle of yes that's pretty cool why not it's kind of weird that you have to walk all the way through the house to get to the living room but you know whatever i could just turn the living room into a man cave why not uh it's upstairs there's another bedroom over here okay with a detached bathroom and then we come over here and it's just upstairs to the lower level, and then there's this place, which has no roof, so that's kind of weird. <laughs> to each their own, I guess. Hmm. Okay, I think... I don't think they're married. I 
don't think they're dating. I'm assuming they're... <laughs> Why is she laughing at things? I guess she doesn't like it, but whatever. Yeah, I think I'm just going to turn the living room into the man cave area. Because, I mean, you basically want stuff that you would have in the living room. Except, you know, a bar. Which, um, I guess I could put over here. Maybe. Hmm. I have to think about this a little bit. I mean, it, I guess it would make the most sense to put the man cave up here. But I also feel like that might be her bedroom. So, I don't want to do that. Not that it really matters to me, but it might to them. Let's see. We've got, we've got the living room. And we've got upstairs. I think I'm going to do it upstairs. It just makes the most sense to me. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. I'll probably move this door over because I don't like it being all the way over there and it's kind of weird. So, whatever. I think this is like an apartment, honestly. But, you know what? It's fine. There's plenty of other places in this town where she can move if this is her bedroom. So, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Let's just get on to the renovation.
All right, so I got everything I need and I just decided to go with like a very dark color palette and I just put a bunch of lights around because he needed four lights and I didn't want to put four ceiling lights and then just have you know, just random lights everywhere and I forgot to put stuff on the table again. I always forget to put things on the table. I don't know why, but it's just a thing I do. So let's just find some stuff to put on the table real quick. Oh yeah, I know what I wanted to put on the table. Um, DS. Popcorn. Yeah, awesome. It's <laughs> probably one of my favorite items, but I can't use it in most of my builds because it was a Dr. Pepper item from a few years ago. A lot of years ago, probably, but yeah. It's not available anymore, so there's that. But anyway, I decided to go with this dark color palette. You know, a bunch of metal textures, like this metal texture. And I used a lot of the stuff that came with um, fast lane stuff because I thought, um, you know, that's what I was going with, so that's what I decided to use, and I just put this in here, you know, because why not? I figure maybe, you know, he could have, like, repurposed it into, like, a drink vending machine or something, you know? I don't know, maybe have some guys over, I, I, whatever. I don't think he'd want to bring any of its dates here, but it's fine. And so, yeah, I think we're just going to turn this in. I, I really like the way it turned out, honestly. It's probably my favorite renovation so far, but... Yeah, I don't really do too many masculine type builds, obviously, but, um, yeah, <laughs> I like it, so we're just gonna turn it in, hopefully he likes it as much as I do, probably won't, but we'll see, and I don't know what's happening to her, but we'll figure it out. Okay, so let's try this again, because I don't actually think he's coming home, I didn't get a notification that said he's coming home, and whenever she called him, she just stuck her other finger in her ear and just screamed la 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 over, over and over again, so, yeah, we're just gonna try it again okay now it's coming over thank you buddy bailey by the way i gave all the lights in here like this cyan tint except for these two ceiling lamps lights lamps not lights but whatever except for the two ceiling lights because um this one had the cyan color already you know programmed into it i guess i don't know but i like the way it looked so i decided to just go with that and they are really loud zuba jima zuba you better like it. Please like it. See what you're doing. Well, congratulations on completing a new man cave remodel. Awesome. Take it myself. Overall, I think you did a good job. Ooh, I got a thousand simoleons. Yes, it's not amazing, but I can't complain much. Okay, so we didn't get any progress towards our thing. Um, did we? Probably not. Nope. That's unfortunate. But at least we got one picture over here oh i guess i probably should check that huh oh buddy bailey whatever all right so i'm just gonna send her home now all right so i need to fix up her house and everything really quick I need to throw out her leftover whatever oh wow it's a lot of water she's gonna have to clean up Alright guys, so I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. I'm sorry about her stench cloud she peed on herself. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you're enjoying the series, please give this video a thumbs up. Feel free to do a comment and subscribe if you haven't already. And if you have any suggestions for this series, then let me know in the comments below. Also, if you have any... Okay, there she goes. Bye. But, um, anyway, if you know of any or if you have any, um, like, consignment type stores for world adventures. I don't really know what they're called. What are they called? Like... Um, places that sell the relics and everything. If you have any of those in your studio or know of any, then please let me know because um, I'm going to have to add some to my world. That way she can just go ahead and go there and buy them to place into some people's houses and stuff because they seem to enjoy that. And I don't actually know if they show up in the consignment store regularly. I don't think they actually do. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye!